You remember the first time that you licked a battery and enjoyed the metallic flavor but didn't care for the little jolt? But then a few hours later, you're somehow jonesing for a battery and that 9 volt is nowhere to be found. Humei Miyashita from the Miyashita Lab and Meiji University in Japan created the Noromaki Synthesizer, a lickable, quote, taste gadget or electronic flavor saver, if you will. It's a part of a broader study of human-centered computing or human-computer interaction. The novel taste display uses ion electrophoresis. It has five gels that contain electrolytes that supply controlled amounts of each of the five basic tastes. Magnesium chloride for your bitter, citric acid for your acidic, glutamic sodium is the umami gel, sodium chloride is your salty, and glycine is your sweet. The device applies different tastes to the user's tongue that roughly correlate to colored lights. Sort of like the same way that Jolly Rancher colors represent natural flavors. When applied to the tongue with no voltage, the user can taste all five tastes. However, when electronic potential is applied, the cations in the gel move to the cathode side and away from the tongue so that the flavor is suppressed. The taste display can reproduce arbitrary tastes by individually suppressing the sensation of each of the five basic tastes. The synthesizer uses electric current for electrophoresis rather than electrically stimulating the tongue. You also don't have to swallow to deliver the taste, so you're just tasting your electronic food. The researchers didn't stress that it wasn't a substitute for food, but they'll likely have to because, you know, people. The study builds off of previous work trying to augment taste using devices. For example, chopsticks and straws that alter flavor by conducting electricity, changing the taste of soup with electric spoons, controlling taste by applying electrodes to the face, and even inserting a device in the mouth and using the force applied when chewing to generate power. Now, it sounds weird. I mean, you know, electronically altering your palate and eating experience. But how many of you out there are heavy on the salt? You can make your food saltier without shocking the ticker. I mean, margaritas with a virtually salted rim. If anything, the device could open up an entirely new multimedia experience, such as in virtual reality or 4D theme park attractions. 